Where am I? Wait, I... I remember, wait. Was I supposed to be in you, eh? Wait, the entrance exam, when... Is... Uh, wait, is this part of the exam? Uh, let me try and, like... What the... Where's my phone? Where's my clothes? Why am I wearing this... Um... Armor! I... Uh, wait, this is... Where is... Wait, 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 um... I remember, uh... My master said, whatever I need to talk to her, I can just... Pray? Well, I guess uh, this is as good a time uh, as any to try. There's no need to pray anymore, my child. But I have... Well, to grant you the wisdom of the gods. Well, wait a minute, who are you? Such a silly child, um, generally, that you have forgotten your master. Wait, wait, wait my master... You're, but then she, the one trained me for these ten months, this whole time, you, you were. Correct, boy, I am, was, and will always be the great goddess Athena. And I have brought you here to serve your purpose. Wait, 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 wait a minute. A purpose? What do you mean a purpose? I, I thought you were just training me to, you know, be a hero. Be number one hero. You know, all my dream to, you know, I, I think that you're actually a goddess who are training me. But what other purpose is there? And why would you Oh, silly boy, do you not realize what is happening? Yes, I decided to take you under my wing. After Mr. All Might, was it, turned his back on you, you were at your lowest point by the time I showed up. And you think I would just. You know, extend an olive branch just to help you become the number one hero of your pitiful world. Sorry to tell you this, but no, I have more pressing matters, much more important and grand plans that require a champion, you could say. But, but why me? Of all the people, why, why would you pick someone who's quirkless, someone who didn't already have power for you to build up upon? It, it makes no sense. I mean, you could have chosen anyone precisely. I could have chosen anyone to train. Why well, chose you? Someone who without power. Someone looked down upon. Yet, of everyone, why did I choose you? Yes, I could have chosen this All Might. I could have chosen this Kotsky. Who knows? Maybe even Stars and Stripes. Yeah, maybe even Midnight could prove to be a more youthful champion than you. But I saw something interesting waiting to you. I don't know how to really describe it, but 
Hmm. Let's just say I feel like my odds with having you as my champion. Is that a uh, good enough reason? Okay, I can understand that, but I really want to go to UA to possibly be the number one hero. You know, it was my dream ever since I was a kid. Even though I was born quirkless, I, I didn't give up on it. And now you're saying that you just ripped me from my world into this one? All for me to be a champion? Not just a champion. My champion. I am the goddess of wisdom. I am a god of war. I'm losing. Never. And if I have to go other places, I will. Especially one that, for some reason, has multiple gods, yet no gods at all. Wait, multiple, yet no gods? Wait, what is that supposed to mean? No. Ignorant child. Of course, your world has multiple, yet also no gods in it. Haven't you noticed how strange it is? All these different cultures, all these different beliefs to converge, yet they can't seem to prove which one is truly right. Even the ones that have similar legends or folk tales, even cryptids. Don't you see what that means? Would you care to elaborate? Ah, yes. I shall. All in due time you shall learn the truth of your world. But now, your training begins. Wait, training? What do you mean training? I, what would you call all that hard work I did all those 10 months up until the entrance exam, which you still wrecked me from? Oh, oh, sweet, sweet child. You thought that was training. You truly thought that little warm-up, trial period, was your training? Well, anything that's just to make sure that you wouldn't give up. Because then you would have been completely worthless to me. I will not have a champion who can't get back up after being knocked down. Wait, 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 wait. Does that mean I am going to break you and repair you? Shape you into my ideal champion. And until then, until you get with the program, until I find no flaws. You can forget about ever going home. This is a good election. This is a good election. Switch! We're to the ground! Wait, wait, what is that rumbling? May as well be Zeus giving his blessing. Zeus, no, sorry. You wish you were that lucky. Who are you? Me? I'm just a humble servant of a goddess. You must obviously know her since 
you're invading one of her villages? So the goddess of wisdom decided to send what? A uh, diplomat. Mmm. Diplomat. Warrior. It depends on you. So, you can fight. Yes. And, in fact, I'll tell you what. I'll be back in, let's say, ten minutes. And I'll try to be diplomatic. And if you still decide you want to fight, we shall fight. But only it will be, it will be me and you. Uh, what your name is? I am Fredros. So many berries. Ah. Oh. So you're the Spartan general of the Silver Soul. To Ares, huh? Hmm. Huh. Well, that would explain the furious aura I feel around you. Alright, well, like I said, ten minutes. You can discuss amongst yourselves. Right, everyone! Seek refuge in Athena Temple while I deal with these invaders. Uh, wait, what, what's happening? It seems like the Spartan general, servant of Ares, Kratos, has come to an attack. Though, you don't want to worry. I'll take care of it. Wait, did, did you say Kratos is here? Yes, the Spartan general. Wait, wait, wait what are you going to do? What? Excuse me? I've not heard of all the atrocities that he's committed, the blood he's spilled along with all his subordinates. They're practically invincible. Why are you one person gonna... Okay. Allow me to explain. This is Athena's village. And I was chosen by Athena to be her champion. As far as I can tell, I'm pretty uh, qualified. In fact, as long as you stay in here, no harm will come to you. I can assure you that you will all survive as long as you listen to me. Is that understood? Do we really want to trust him with our lives? Hmm? You! Yes? You're the Oracle. Indy, I am. Tell them that they are going to be alright. Hmm. I have to confess, it's different now. Excuse me. The future is different compared to what it was supposed to happen. How so? By not end up the in depth conversation like I am now. No, you. You're just not supposed to be here. What? Yes, the vision I had is pretty much everyone here dying, except me. Really? Yes. I foresaw the Spartan general coming here, slaughtering all the villagers until he arrives at this temple. And kill these two. 
pointing at Calliope and Lysandra. Wait, why'd you single them out? You will find out soon enough. Hey. All I can say is I am in the dark at the moment. Like I said, you're not supposed to be here. Practically everyone here is supposed to die. It's just... Very well. If anything, I'll deal with Kratos one way or another. Wait, 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 wait. Excuse me. Please do not kill him. For me and my daughter's sake. You want me to spare the life of Kratos? Uh, what was your names again? I'm Lysandra, and this is my daughter, Calliope. I can't tell you at the moment why, but please do not kill him. Are you serious? No, okay, no, screw it. Tell me why. I okay, uh, Calliope. Do you know Kratos? He's my father. <laughs> I'm sorry. What? Yes, he's my husband, and. My child's father. Really? Yes. Really? Indeed. Well, I guess that does change my plans, doesn't it? Wait, does he know you're here? Uh, we never told him, but. We were going to be here. He was off, you know, on his damn rampage. Yeah. <laughs> so you're saying he... Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Does this mean... Nah, that can't be right. What is it? Champion of... Athena. Well, um, if they're here, Kratos has no idea that they're here. He ordered his men to burn the village to the ground. And as you said, he was supposed to slaughter every much everyone, including them. If he doesn't even know they're here, and he's indulging in this rampage, Aries, that maniacal little bitch. Drab legged, fiery bearded. Can't believe this. What? Did you find something out? Yes! Aries, you were trying to get your husband to kill you two. No, 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 that, that's impossible. Oh, it's possible. Air, Lord Ares would never do such a thing. He's a, he knows a protector of women. Hmm. Yes. Well, maybe he's a bit different from what you know. Yeah. No, I'm not even so sure myself. All of you things for certain, I am going to have to stop Kratos. But as a favor to you and your daughter, I shall not kill him. For that, you have my word. Thank you. 
Just don't thank me yet. I'm still going to fight him. And I can tell he's very stubborn. Especially with that aura around him. Wait, what? Don't worry about it. I'll deal with it. Somehow. Alright, I have returned. The ten minutes are up. So, Spartan, what is your decision? I choose to fight. I will kill you. Well, you can at least try, definitely. <sighs> Fine, but if I win, you go home, you and all of your Spartans. Do we have a deal, Kratos? You seem quite confident for a child. Ugh. It's been a long time since I've been caught that. Yeah. If anything, you should be grateful. I give you a chance to go home. I wish I had that chance. Very well. In the unlikely event that you do win, we shall return to Spartan. Quietly. Good, good, good. So, how do you want to do this? Excuse me. Do you want to use that fury of yours? Those blades? Or are we going barehanded? Yes. I've noticed that you don't seem to be carrying any weapons on you. Has your goddess decided to abandon you in your time of need? No. I just don't need weapons. Most of the time. You know, since people are usually smarter than this and choose not to fight me. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> This is going to be fun. Are you sure you wish to fight me barehanded, boy? Ugh, that's right. Uh, you make a good point. Yes, sir, I do need to make sure you survive. Okay, fine, how about this? No powers. No weapons. It's just going to be a bare knuckle fight. But you're gonna have to put the blades away. Can you? Very well. What? What the? I mean, yeah, I broke the leg hurts, but I didn't expect. That noise. Wait, that doesn't usually happen. Wait, you're you're not Kratos anymore, are you? For the glory of Ares. Oh goody, he's possessed. So I guess uh, there's no holds barred in this fight anymore. And his broken leg is fixed. Just great. Just perfect. <sighs> Sandra, Calliope, I might have to put the old man down. Yeah. Alright. Let's go, Bubba. Let's get this on. Wait, what? Hey, hey I'm over here, you little old-ass bastard. Why are you... And for the temple, oh, you sly! Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how that is. So, um, please tell me you're still you in there. Even the smidges amount. For the glory of heaven. Uh, I do what I do. They can't risk him getting past me. Uh, wait. I remember one of the first things Lady Athena taught me. I'm gonna have to challenge him as a champion. Uh, maybe that will snap him out of this. But at the very least, make it so we don't end up going to Hades too soon. I hope this works. <laughs> Well, damn. It's going to say in Japanese. It all means nothing if he doesn't accept it. Hopefully, Ares and or Kratos are too prideful. That they'll accept us. Me, who me? Oh, well, oh, I love the arrogant motherfuckers. It's going to be so much more fun than I anticipated. Huh. I wish I didn't expect him to speak in Greek. I'm going to share my conquest by bringing your little. That's. I see no problem with it, brother. And besides, it was you who decided to force my hand by bringing your little puppet to one of my villages. And <laughs> it seems as though my pet has found out why. Don't be ridiculous, woman. I have no other reason to conquer a village, burn it to the ground, other than my own mm, hobbies. <laughs> really? Because I've been looking through uh, my uh, champion. And for what he's gathered, you somehow forgot to mention to Kratos that his family is there. Ah. Oh, yes, brother. The jig is up. And is that why you've decided to bestow upon him? A rage your faced ability. Don't be so ridiculous. He could have had that way before I even gifted him the blades. Yeah, whatever. The fact that he's able to regenerate as well as, you know, <laughs> keep fighting. Despite the God knows how many ugh, injuries he sustains, you had nothing to do with that at all. Please. Ugh. Look, that actually, I actually don't know where that's from. Excuse me? Yeah, for some reason. Once I bestowed upon him the blades, is something swift? What? Wait, 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 wait a minute. What do you mean, clicked? Are you saying that you unintentionally unlocked an ability that he had dormant? Uh, that's the best excuse I can think of. I've never seen something so 
potentially disastrous. But one thing's for certain, he did not really have that until those blades were wrapped around his arms, and I did not give that to him. Wait, wait, oh! The fire. Excuse me? Primordial fire. That's. You used that to make the blaze, didn't you? Wow. You did. Oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense. And he's a Spartan. Oh my god, you. Yeah, you. Oh, you, you really did it this time. I'm sorry. You gave him. Weapons imbued with primordial fire, and you bound them to his hands with flaming chains. He is a Spartan for one. They are known for having warriors who would rather die than go home losers. Mixed that in with primordial fire, let alone the weapons, and somehow having him know how to use them so quickly. Ugh. He made his determination into even more disastrous power. And you were going to have him slaughter his family? Uh, yeah, I'll uh, to make it a better warning. Oh, yeah, you, you, you screwed up. You know that, right? Excuse me? Nope. You, you, I don't know how to tell you this, uh, gently, but, no, bring it, you're fucked. What? Yeah, you, you, you have damned yourself. You know, the only way, huh, you better hope my champion kills him. Well, as long as he has his, oh, binding him to me, there, there's no way. Huh. What? Don't tell me there's a way for him to break your oath. No, no, there. Hell, my son. Despite me making such a disappointment. He's a. He holds that. So. There's, there's nothing to worry about there. Your son that hates you. Yes. Yes. But also, he likes living. How sure are you that that's true? Uh, I mean, he can't hate me that much to the point where he would just give up his life. Right? I'm pretty sure Kratos wouldn't care unless you have him, you know, the best defenses possible. And even then, that Spartan's determination is. <gasps> It could be monstrous. Well, you may have made the point. I may have. Darn I. Just pray my guy wins. And that I could possibly convince Kratos not to seek vengeance upon you. Huh. Yeah, I, I really screwed up, didn't I? You don't mess with a man's family. Well, well you have to help me, right? The sister? Mm. Excuse me. You heard me. Beg for it. On your knees. And pray to the gods of Athena 
Вот. You. If you don't want your champion to find out that you were going to have him slaughter his family, or have him come after you, but you know he will. <laughs> you will beg for it. Wait, wait, what? Am I scared of? No, he's just a normal human with a determination buff. I am immortal. I am a great god. We can't die. Uh, yeah, we can't die. Seriously, I, I, I can take care of him myself. Let him find out. Well, where did you get the stones all of a sudden? Okay, okay, fine. You, you don't want to beg me? You don't have to. But don't expect my assistance. Please, seriously, yeah, you may have made a pretty powerful champion, but there's no way he's going to beat Kratos. And once he kills uh, that wife and daughter of his, <laughs> he'll definitely be the strongest, most threatening, powerful warrior has ever been conceived. Just you wait. You're the one that's going to be on their knees begging. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't even know why I'm so worried. Lee Athena. Oh, yeah. My champion has decided to call upon me. Things aren't looking too good for you, Aries. You sure I won't start begging? Please. Yeah. I can, can always find another Spartan or hell. Whatever. Doesn't matter. It just means he's either won or he's begging for your help. Thing is, if you won, then my champion's dead. I can always make another one. Yeah, it doesn't really matter to me. But if he is begging for your help, that means hell yes, I have created a very formidable champion in which I deserve a pat on the back. Why not? Uh, your ambitions and arrogance is going to cost you your life one of these days. <laughs> Nonsense. Whatever. Yes, Izuku. Oh my gosh, I have decided to call upon you to, uh, you know, give you a report on my mission. Yeah. Would you like to hear it now, or shall we wait for a different time, if you're busy now? Hmm, alright, that's the report. Alright, uh, tell me how your battle with this Spartan, you know, Turned out, it was his army. Did you uh, win, or you require assistance? I won't be mad if you do, but I will have to, you know, intensify your training once you come back. No, no, no. There is no need for that. But if enough, I have. Want to tell you that my mission was a complete success. The Spartan army is returning home, and all the followers, including the villagers, are safe and sound. And I am pleased to report there are no casualties whatsoever. Oh, really? No casualties whatsoever? When it comes to my side? Excuse me for a moment. <laughs> Suck it, Aries. Fuck you. Well, either way, so I take it that you defeat 
Kratos. Huh. If anything, it had to be done. Shame, he was a very interesting warrior. Now, Lady Athena. Um, uh, how should I put this? Well, what is it? Did you kill him or not? Did he escape or not? It seems to be very, uh, you know. So, just tell me, is this on your own? Do you need help finding him? Or something? Did you lose sight of the corpse? Or, you know, the signs of life were non existent? No, uh, no, I didn't lose sight of him or anything. He didn't escape. He, he's alive. In, in fact, he's right now uh, hugging to his wife and daughter, who are actually very happy to see him at the moment. So, nothing else. Yeah. Just letting you know that. Yes, I defeated Kratos and, and knocked him out of his uh, strange little possession type thing. Uh, equally honest, the Oracle's been kind of weird, though. Still been cryptic as hell. Starting to say something like the most of Sparta or something. Kind of weird, but yeah. yeah, you know, it's an Oracle, so. Ah, oh, oh, okay, so what you're saying is that Spartan is still alive. In fact, he's talking and spending time with his wife and daughter, and uh, yeah, all is well. Okay, um, we can talk some other time, with, uh, you, you know. Um, Yes, uh, I'll be by soon to collect you. Huh? Yeah, you, you are fun. Royally so, actually. Excuse me. Yeah, you see, yes, I may be pleased that my champion defeated yours. Oh, so he's dead. <laughs> no. You wish. He's not dead, no. He's a goo. Apparently challenged him the way I taught him. And luckily, you know, your champion accepted. What? Oh, yes. It seems as though my... The champion is more stronger than yours. But no, that, that, that's impossible. Let's worry about the main issue here. Your champion is not dead. He is talking to his wife and kid right now. So, if anything, you need to possibly do damage control. Explain. Right now, all you can do is hope that he hasn't figured out that you tried to get him to kill his family. So, as far as he knows, it was possibly due to his own bloodlust and nothing that has anything to do with you. And that is your hope. Because, if he finds out that you have something to do with it, well, let's just say the God of War realm might be open. You, you really think he has a chance to kill me? Uh, I, mean, I could see it. No, 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 no. I... He... What if he is? What well, if he finds a way, but... If he finds a way to kill 
one of us, he could kill all of us. Yes. Yes, he could. So, are you gonna help me? Oh no, you brought this upon yourself. You fix your own damn mess. What? You shouldn't have brought him to my village. It's my territory. Besides, me and the other gods of Olympus have gotten sick of your crap. Mm -hmm. What? What? Sister, don't you sister me. You have damned yourself. If nothing else, just make sure he doesn't find out. That is your only real option. I sent him there. Yeah, but if I think he'll play dumb like you didn't know that they would be there. Mm -hmm. uh, I can't believe this. Hey, take my advice. Don't take my advice. All I know is you need to clean up your mess. Because I would hate to be on the wrong side of things here. Now I'm going to go Collect my champion and give him his reward. You just decide to unfuck yourself. Wait, 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 I still am. Well, I'm going to open. Oh, great, what stars. Not really. I couldn't ask my questions about Ares for you. So, I'm afraid we're at a dead end. I do believe in my lord's innocence, but... It seems too much of a coincidence that I was sent here. Oh, especially considering my family were so close. Yeah. Yeah, I, I get that. But seriously. It seems, it seems like, you know, Hillary's might have that ulterior motives of you showing up here. If anything, it wasn't for me. We hear you, well, yes, Lord, everyone, including them. Yes. I, I would have. But thanks to you, I didn't take any lives today. For that, you have my deepest gratitude. In fact, rely on me. Please come forward. Chris, what are you doing? I would be honored if you would take my daughter's hand in marriage. <laughs> what? Yes, you gonna be shy. No. What? No. I don't understand. Why not? Does she not suit her taste? <sighs> oh, no. Seriously, I, I'm 19. How old is she? I, I forgot her. Lysandra. How old is Plyby at this moment? She would be, um... Oh, that's a good question, I believe. Oh, yeah, she just turned 12, I believe. Uh, it's hard I can hear it. The SWAT team already. 
No, no, I, 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 I was, I refuse. I'm flattered, but no. It's strange. Why not? Ah, uh, let's see. I'm 19, and where, where I'm from, the youngest should at least be 18 years of age before anything could be considered a true relationship like this. So, you know, uh, strange. I went to the Agogi. I and my mentor were close. What? Wait. Oh. 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 God. The Agogi. Oh. Wait a minute. That's right. I forgot. Yeah. Spartans. Oh. Oh dear. Mm. Well. Yes. Where I'm from, there is a age requirement. If I were to even entertain this, I, yeah, I, I will never see a live day again. So she has to be at least 18 for you to consider it. Yes. Yes, that is correct. Very well. Calliope. You shall wait until you are of age to the correct parameters of young Midoriya. Okay. Wait, you still? Of course. You saved not only this village, but my family and me. Oh, you're you're not joking. No, I am not. Of course, of course, you're not. Yeah, damn Spartans. Well, um, you, you already sent your. Your soldiers home. Well, I guess you guys might as well go on home too. Wait, do the Sparta. Yeah, Virgil. What do you want with him? It's not for him to go so Sparta. He, he's not dead. No. I fully remember he. How this was supposed to go down if we weren't for your interruptions. Everyone here was supposed to die. Well, except me and I'll continue. And he was supposed to slaughter his child, child Calliope, as well as his wife, Lysandra. And bear the reminder of his sins through the ashes of their remains. Excuse me? Yes, that would be when he was dubbed the ghost of Sparta, but now I see something completely different. He still gains the moniker. Of course, of Sparta, but the reason is far different. Oh, now color me in the street. How so? How would he still gain this title? Though it may not be the death of his entire family, one is still to die. Not soon, but at a later date. Uh huh? Yes. Though not all of his family shall be slain, 
there will still be a death in his family that causes him to retain their memory with him always. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No. I'm afraid not. You see, Ghost of Sparta, you shall still gain your title. Yet, it is not through the same tragedy. So you say that I shall lose one of my loved ones. Correct. How? That I cannot tell you. No. No. I'm getting sick of them oracles. You are always vague, and you end up hitting everyone else through this vagueness. When, as soon as you tell us, we would do everything we can to prevent it. Explain. See about it. You see, you, you know the whole story about how the Titan is got an old throne. You know how the reason why Kronos decided to swallow his kids. Oh, man, that sounded so much worse. Either way, he was told by an oracle. That they shall dethrone him. So that led him to not be celibate, not remain abstinent, but for each of his kids that his wife conceived, he would, he would eat, he would eat, he would swallow, consume them. And so there, his wife had enough. And, yeah, since I say stronger, then overthrew him with the free the rest of his siblings. So what you're saying is, we do nothing? Yes, you see, in trying to prevent something from happening, you ensure that it does happen. That sounds ludicrous. I know, but I see it actually, you know, I've seen the patterns. Like, <laughs> how should I say? Oedipus. Who was that? Oh, yes, he was prophesied to kill his father. And, you know, banging his mom. No. Yeah, he ended up doing it. Which part? Both. You see, what happened was, his father heard about this prophecy. So he has his son taken away. He was supposed to be killed, but, you know, so he decided, no, just give him someone else to raise. Then, Son hears about the prophecy, and he doesn't want to kill his parents, who he thinks are his birth parents. And on the way to his home, he runs into his father, who he does end up killing. That he ends up marrying his father's wife, and he started getting all down and dirty. No. Yes. In which, yes, uh, someone swallowed some hot coals, someone poked out their eyes, and that's all she wrote. No. Yeah. That one thing. Ugh. At the end of the day, yes. It's a common pattern that I noticed. You learn about the future. You see that as a bad one, you try to prevent it, but you ensure that it happens, and all you can do is blame yourself. So, all I can say is, don't try to fight fate. 
Are you sure it's going to work? No! But what other choices do you have? <laughs> <laughs>